So my name is Rahul, um, I go to Monash University and I'm studying um, engineering and commerce and my internship is for two months in Shenzhen. So I'm working for an engineering company um, that's dealing in chemical engineering and sustainable energy. Um, but um, the company out of Shenzhen, the office out of Shenzhen, is um, looking to transform it into a financial hub on the mainland, um, where they also have an um, office in Hong Kong. So they want to um, develop this company into becoming the financial hub on the mainland by creating a private equity company. Um, so I was tasked with um, finding out the frameworks of different um, types of um, major private equity companies. So I looked at um, how companies built up their structures and how they became profitable um, as well as prestigious. I was also tasked with um, creating a document that outlined these frameworks and also compared um, the strengths and weaknesses of them. Yeah, yeah, they've all been great. Um, my supervisor, he's so kind and really helpful. Um, and he himself was an intern, so I found that to be like a really good starting point. And he was just so open and helpful. And um, we have another colleague here and she's just so nice and kind and she's always helping me out, always giving me things to do, always asking how I am. She's really good. I'm not sure if I can put it down to just one thing. The apartment is definitely something to look forward to. It's one of the best things about it, honestly. And I think, um, yeah, the interns I'm with, they also really help to make it a really fun, exciting program. And also, I don't know, just everything about it, even the, the um, activities that they plan for us, all the Chinese business seminars and the um, cultural activities, like I'm really looking forward to that. And everything is just so exciting about the program, yeah. Probably the bikes or the food. Now the bikes, yeah, the bikes. It's just, it's just so typically, it's just so typically Chinese. Like it's just such an experience to go on those bikes, especially at like two o'clock at night and you just want to go home. You just say Walmart and they just take you there and you just, you just go up next to all these buses and cars that are driving around and it's just so fun. It's, it's really exciting. Probably the driving as well. <laughs> Every time I was on the bus and you just look out the window and see a car just trying to merge into the lane. Like there was no giving way or anything. It was just, you just hope for the best and just go into that lane. Like I was scared that we were about to crash like four times. Um, but if not the transport, then well, what else was the craziest thing? Oh, trying cow's blood for the first time. That was a bit exciting, a little bit crazy. I had it on my chopsticks and I asked a colleague, I was like, what's this? And he's like, cow's blood. Like it was the most normal thing in the world, but like it was an experience, it was really good. Def um, definitely have an open mind about it. You know, it's, uh, I guess you'd expect it to be all, all work and no play, I guess, but there's China is, like Shenzhen is just such a, vibrant city everything about it is just so fun and free and you can do almost anything here like just have an open mind be outgoing and just have a great time you know always just look for other things to do because there's so much to do here